Hi everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I developed a simple journaling page in this journal that I'm developing. And if you've been on my channel for quite some time, then you know that sometime late last year I got this journal and I decided to dedicate it to the affirmations that are part of my daily routine. So I decided to develop a visual journal in which I could put a little bit of a note with my affirmations and then create a scene around it or like a visual atmosphere around it. And I decided to do this with some interesting girl stickers which I had purchased. So basically I thought that the girls kind of embody my spirit and um, they kind of like represent me and then everything around it could be the atmosphere or the mood that I'm going for which kind of represents the affirmation so yeah i've been developing this journal and i'm going to link the first couple of process videos that i did for this journal in the description box below so this is now the third page in my journal and once again it's all color coordinated and i've kind of like decided the colors beforehand based on my focal image which i'm going to be placing in a bit so you'll get a sense of why i chose these colors and basically the girl is dressed in a white sweatshirt with like white track pants and basically like a quad white set with green shoes with green sneakers basically so the color pop of the sneakers is what inspired the entire color palette for today's page and i had actually filmed this video long time back but somehow i never got to editing it because last year was a little rough for me personally and there were times when I just couldn't find the motivation to, you know, just go through my camera roll and pull out all that footage and edit it. But I'm kind of like getting back in my groove now. And um, I think like continuing with this affirmation journal is exactly what I need even right now with the kind of momentum that I have. So yeah, um, there are days when things are a little tough and then there are days where I feel like these affirmations are exactly what kind of give me the power to go through most of the things you know most of the sad times or the turbulent times so yeah basically i'm I'm just rambling <laughs> what i'm trying to say is that um it's a good idea to continue with this journal for me um i have recently started once again uh adding more pages to this journal so as in when i'm getting the time i'm kind of like editing these videos and trying to put them out over here so this one was an older video like i said and this one was filmed last year itself, but I'm just editing it now. I wanted to kind of go in sequence. I'm kind of like a completist, sequential, sequentialist, I don't know if that's a word, <laughs> kind of a person. So I wanted to not ruin the order of the pages. And that's why I'm doing this um, in the order. So anyway, I have given you enough information about the setup and um, as you can see i have basically experimented with a lot of different pattern papers and textured papers over here i had a bunch of these sticker sheets which i had actually uh, manufactured in collaboration with somebody and some of the stock got left out it didn't sell out so i decided to use it for my personal projects and so out of those sticker sheets this green sort of diamond like sticker or this green stone sticker was uh, was one of my favorites and just like the previous two videos that i did while building this journal i added the affirmation using this little label maker that i have so yeah that was the overall theme and that's pretty much what i did for this journal and um, if you have any suggestions for me on what colors i should experiment with uh, for my future spreads in this journal then please do put that in the comments box below because sometimes i realize that i kind of like always go back to my favorite colors over and over again so i'd like a little bit of a challenge and if somebody can <laughs> sort of push me out of my comfort zone and tell me hey do this color then I'd feel more motivated to try and do a journal spread in that color. Of course, I might not have all the supplies, um, you know, all my journaling supplies in that color. But then again, that's part of the fun because I can sort of like go dig deep into my stash and see if I can create something out of the out of the materials that I have 
within the color palette that you've given me so yeah i love to receive comments from you so make sure that you put in some ideas suggestions and comments for me below and if you are new here then please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because i promise that i listen to everything that you say and i will definitely make videos on whatever topics that you request so i'm a good kid that way so please do subscribe <laughs> okay so that's pretty much all the talking for today there's just a few minutes of uh, the video left for you to watch to enjoy the spread so have a look at it and then let me know in the comments how you found today's spread and i will see you very very soon in another video bye bye